And hello, YouTube world. It's a great Saturday. Good to see you again on the weekend here. Mm. Nice fresh coffee. I'm I'm been taking um like milk products out of my diet, so I'm I've been drinking my coffee without creamer, and it's absolutely freaking me out. I don't know if I like it at all. I might just have to say fuck it and put creamer back in. Um, but anyways, guys, I hope together here today um i'm gonna be look oh crap look at that right off the bat too okay so uh jam it looks this is this is so annoying this is so annoying sorry guys one second here um fuck, it just might look like nothing's gonna fucking work out today uh the communities are down so i can't do my multiplayer thing apparently um <laughs> as you can see on my screen and it looks like my internet's gonna be giving me shit all freaking day again all right i just want to play games guys <laughs> they're driving me up absolutely up the wall so um i'm gonna have to keep this in the corner here i might be blocking my chat a bit but i gotta keep an eye just to make sure that you know, we still got our, uh, our shit together here. So let's load up seven days of dive. What I think I'm going to do is just um, do some grinding on um, my single player. We may as well get some single player done because I haven't made an episode since the last one. So it's not like we'd really be missing out on much. And I mean, today's PS4 days, so may as well, right? Hey, what's up, Elite? What's, what's going on? Oh, oh, yeah, there it goes again. There it goes again. Oh, boy. <laughs> Is it bad on your guys' end? Like, is it is it really lagging out on you? Hey, Hot Chocolate Gamer, what's up, dude? Uh, TCW, how you doing, buddy? DXG, what's up, guys? <laughs> oh, well, at least we still got to watch. Yeah, that just kind of sucks. I like doing the multiplayer thing. But, eh, like I said, wasn't meant to be. It's not meant to be. Um, hopefully my internet, it hasn't come to a stop, which is really good. Because yesterday it was just coming to a stop. Like, it would just go from green, green, green to zero. And that would be it. Um, and then to stay there for a while, right? Completely disconnecting people. But if it's a little laggy, I think we can, uh, I think we can deal with it. Hey, what's up, Summer? How you doing? Oh, man, Jer, seriously, dude? I'm starting to freaking hate Shaw, man. Oh, well, not starting. I already do, but Jesus. <laughs> It seems like it's good for a week, and then it's crap for a month again. Then it's good for a week, and then it's crap for a month again. All right. Um, oh, wait. No, it's button hooked. Oh, wait. You know what? I'm going to load this one up. I forget which one this one actually is. So let's go ahead and load this one up. Um, I, I don't know if I have my Castle Miranda one loaded. Um, but it'd be kind of cool to go and check out that playthrough. Maybe do a little bit of that to uh, to pass today's episode. Is there any way you can large amounts of concrete mix? Yeah, you, you make it, dude. <laughs> uh, you just grind stuff and you make a concrete mix, man. Um, Pie Eater, how are you, man? Welcome to the stream. I've been watching since 42K, I think. That's awesome, dude. So um, are you guys, I need, to, I need a little bit of feedback here. Are you guys getting a lot of lag on your end? I just want to make sure it's not too bad. <laughs> I just looked over at my Discord chat and they're talking about gray hairs. Oh, I'm glad I still have like 80 years until that happens. No, you're not. Okay, cool. Well, as long as it's not like, um, like I don't think it's too bad if it goes like for a couple seconds like I'm, I'm watching it do. Um, but let me know, guys, if it gets too bad. I'll, uh, I'll try to sort it out. <laughs> I'm not getting like, okay, thanks, guys. Much appreciated. What's up, Squid? How you doing? Um, dude, I, I don't really do shout outs per se, but, um, if you want to have a conversation with me, dude, we'll have a conversation. All right. Holy crap. Seven days to, uh, load my old game save. I actually forget which one this is, to be honest. This might be, um, oh, yeah. oh, it is. Is this my castle? Oh, it is my castle Miranda. Oh, wait, is it? Is it? Yes, it is. It's my castle Miranda save. Ooh, I'm thirsty. Drink fluids. Okay. Um, so this save here, guys, what you're seeing right here is literally what started it all. Um, day 359. I don't even know when the next Horde Night is, is either. Um, this is my original playthrough. Oh, do you guys remember the rant Rantipatorium? Do you remember this room? I'd sit in my chair and I'd do a little bit of a rant. <laughs> 
Oh my god, has my channel changed since back in the day. I'm getting chills here. This is actually kind of fun, going out and checking out the, uh, the original. This is my original. This game save, I started when this game came out on console. So this is an original game save with all of the original settings. Um, so if we go and look, I wonder if scrap is an option. Oh, it is too. So it did add the scrap in. Uh, there's going to be some stuff that's missing, right? Um, I can't think off the top of my head what I can show you that would be missing. But remember this cave? We, we filled in the cave. This is my digs. We got um, Jeff. I think this is Jeff here. Oh, I can't even remember these guys' names. Jeff, um, it was someone else. And then it was fucking Bob. Stupid fucking Bob. Bob has a treasure map though. <laughs> I love it. Oh, this is such a this is such a um, like a, kick, a kickback. Okay, what's uh, what's my food and everything at? I should probably look at getting something to eat. Oh, look at this! My original little water hole. Um, I'll turn my headlamp off there. My original little water hole that I made. Oh, you know what? The water on this map is probably still gray. It probably still has that gray water. Oh my god, this is insane. Okay. Let's eat some meat stew here. Um, I don't want to starve. We're going and taking a look around. So, uh, first time after patch thirteen. Um, this this is one of my old old saves, dude. Um, um, the patch really doesn't apply to these ones as much. Um, I'm sure it might have done some like small changes to it, but uh, because it's an original save, it's still the original um, components and stuff, right? Like, there's going to be. Um, Ah, oh, shit. What did they just recently add that wasn't in, originally in the game? I can't remember off the top of my head, but here's my bed station up here. This was a lot of work. Um, I was going to say this is when you still had to make stuff, but there's still no painting on consoles, so you still literally have to make your blocks. Uh, but this playthrough here, like day 359, we're actually quite into it. Um, so up here we have like my safe room, my panic tunnels. Uh, there's a way to get up to the surface from here. Uh, this is actually my original hole. This is the first hole I made to go down into the cave. So that, oh, wow. It's like doing a little bit of a tour. And then this just kind of goes back around to that tunnel that leads down to the, um, the horde base. Uh, th this is a playthrough where I got millions of views on the playthrough. Um, I sh this actually looks pretty damn good. I need to get back in the building. Uh, but anyways, this is, uh, the security area. This is just a random door into a hole. There's actually nothing down there. Now, hopefully I don't get a surprise bear because that happened last time. Here we go. I'll keep my melee on me just in case. Uh, we have our security guard here. He's, um, he's guarding the place with his shrooms. Uh, what we have in here is a little bit of a grow up for, um, herbs and spices. Um, now, I did put plants in here, but they, they disappear anyways, right? Like, you can put them down, but eventually they'll disappear because there is no actual sun. Uh, but I tried to make a grow up back in here. <laughs> yeah, it was so much fun. Let's go up here and see what's going on. Just make sure there's no zombies or anything. Okay, no, we're good. Uh, and I was going to do something up here, but I don't think I ever actually got around to it. Doesn't look like it. Uh, so down this way, uh, what we have is a panic tunnel that lead to all the different buildings in town. So all the buildings lead into this tunnel underground and into like my main fortress base here. That's pretty cool. Hey. Oh, I see what this is. I was like, why is there a ladder here? It's my access to, uh, to the top of all of this. Oh my god. This brings back so many memories, guys. 364 is Horde Night. Okay, thank you very much. Much appreciated. Uh, Jer, uh, I remember when you didn't show your face in live streams. Um, dude, I, I honestly, sometimes I, I do, sometimes I don't. Um, I, I get, um, like, abdominal migraines, which doesn't, like, debilitate me, but it drains everything out of me, and I literally look like I just went on a crack binge after one. So sometimes I just don't use my webcam, man, because people don't like seeing people that don't look well, right? Um, okay, so this is my place here. Uh, what I have here is a drop pit to get up. Uh, from bottom to top. You guys are very familiar with this design. I've done it tons of times. Drop hits are always great. You just put a few things down. You're good to go. Uh, so let's go ahead and go up top here. I will show you guys my garage. Uh, did you make all of that yourself? Oh, yes, Cassie. This is um, this is a playthrough my channel took off on. Um, I, I, oh, you probably have not never seen. Oh, wait until you see. This is nothing. This is absolutely nothing. This is just um, like my, my base base. Uh, so there's, okay, fun story about this, right? 
um, why this tunnel looks like this is because when I started this playthrough, right, um, I was making a tunnel like this down to uh, down to the um, down to the horde base. And fun fact, if your tunnel uh, was at an angle, um, not like that, I'm sorry. If your tunnel was at an angle like this with the ramp blocks, your bike would actually get stuck in it. You, you weren't able to ride up something this, uh, this steep. So I had to make one that was, uh, that was like half, right? The, the, oh shit, what do you call them? Uh, the two pieces, the two piece ones. Here we go. Those ones there. Uh, so I could ride up and down. So this was actually a scratch tunnel. Um, it's still there, but... It was a scratch tunnel. And at one point in time, you could ride your mini bike through bars. Actually, you know what? Oh, shit. Where's my mini bike? <laughs> I don't even know where my mini bike is. Where are you? Oh, it's probably outside. Okay, I see it. Um, but at one point in time, too, on console, you could ride your um, bike through um, through pillars, but you can't do that anymore. I get it, though. I, I really do get it. Like, you shouldn't be able to ride your bike through pillars if you can't walk through them, right? <laughs> but um, that's what we used to do is just put pillars up, ride our bikes into the garage, and we're good to go. So um, up there is just a flat land. There's really not much going on up there. So let's go ahead and take a little boot, a little boot, a little bit of a run out. Uh, so what I did here, too, is I made it so that I can either take a jump up there and hop my way in through the... Through the pillars up there but it doesn't work anymore so i can't do it um so yeah like this 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 playthrough has a lot behind it um cassie actually this has some of my um, my best builds in it this playthrough here has some uh a couple of my best builds in it uh but yeah as you can see like we, we can't do it anymore so i had to make another tunnel beside it um oh wait no this tunnel was to get out and this tunnel was to get in that's that's how i had it and then i had to bash these out because well i couldn't ride my mini bike and the jump's kind of useless now we don't uh <laughs> i mean i could go for a jump but i'm not going anywhere uh so here i did um a little bit i forget what you kind of call these gardens but the the gardens that are different levels and crap i kind of kind of did this here it's kind of cool look at all the corn i love it uh all the potatoes awesome awesome okay let's get out of here oh <laughs> can't get my shit together here let's get out this way i remember when you first found out they took riding bikes through pillars out oh wow yeah that was a while ago okay so what i started doing is i started building homes right because i i got bored i built my base we're good to go this is the first one i built on this playthrough this one's a cabin and <gasps> Smashed my window. Son of a bitches. Anyways, actually, this this is running really, really well. Why is this running so well? What? Guys, I'm just realizing that this thing's not stuttering like crazy. I actually had to stop playing this playthrough um, because of the stuttering issues. Like, I couldn't walk more than 10 feet without pausing every second. Um, shit. Damn. Okay. Well, anyways, uh, let's go ahead and start taking a look around. I'll show you the first house here. This is Casa Jeff over here. Um, I named this one after a viewer. Oh, Casa Richie. Was it Richie? I can't remember exactly, but... Um, oh, shit. Look at this place. It's gotten bashed a few times by zombies. Assholes. But this is my uh, this is my cabin build. And you got to remember, too, like this is all legit blocks. This is legit brick. That's legit flagstone. Um, I had to build this all by hand and do it accordingly so it all would match, right? Uh, but we got our first floor here with a uh, this roof, even even still, um, was a challenge to make just because it was all wooden stuff. And as you can see, I had to do like some wonky things to try to get the physics right. But we got it. Uh, I should have turned zombies off just so I don't get smashed in this playthrough. I'm almost like seeing how well this is running. I'm almost wanting to bring castle miranda back maybe just turn off the zombies and just do a build um i think that would be cool uh cabinets look what you can do with cabinets i don't know if you knew you could do this um cassie but if you flip your cabinet sideways it actually gives you a little bit of a trim in the floor like that i forgot about that trick too uh but of course we have our main area here uh we have our kitchen over here which has a nice little feature called a pizza oven check this out slide your pizza right in there nice and tasty yeah that's right um so this is a kitchen you guys have all seen a kitchen uh we got one bedroom in here nice little bedroom with a um walk through bathroom here so this is like the main floor bathroom right uh you have access from the front and you have access from the master oh and look at look at the old barn wood this still has the old barn wood texture 
Um, that shows you guys how much this game has changed, even the last year and a half we've been playing this. Um, how long ago did you last play this world? It's been a while, dude. It's been a while. Because honestly, I was so pissed, man. I had to stop playing it just because it was really, really bad. Uh, holy shit. Um, Steven Irvine with uh, $50 um, A. Is that Australian, dude? It says A, $50. <laughs> I've actually never seen that before. But thank you very much for the tip, dude. Very much appreciated. Awesome community we have here. Because, uh, yeah, you guys know how well it's going with YouTube right now. Which, honestly, I don't care about, guys. Um, talk about that a little bit, too. Uh, I've actually decided in January I'm going to go back and pick up a part-time job to take off the financial stress of trying to do this. Um, and just get back into doing whatever the fuck I enjoy, right? Because, honestly, that's what YouTube's about to me. Uh, but anyways, got another room in here. Nice little room. Really not too much to write home about here. Um... I remember in your first building this. Yeah, you, I must have, I still have a lot of old fans around. You know, every once in a while I forget about that. Like, a lot of you have been here for a while. Um, but yeah, like, this is my first playthrough, guys. I really recommend if you're going to watch any of my playthroughs, watch this one. This, this is my favorite playthrough. Like, just, I haven't been able to fall in love with a playthrough like I did this one. Okay, so in here we got our master bedroom. Uh... I should have actually changed that to just, just glass glass. Ah, no, the privacy is nice. Anyways, this is our master bedroom here. A uh, nice big peaked roof or vaulted. I forget what it's called. And we got a nice little walk-in closet with a whole ton of nightstand storage <laughs> for all for all your clothes and your end time needs. I loved it. Hey, Soundlog, what's up, dude? Uh, do I like pineapple? Uh, I'm afraid to answer that, but yes, I do enjoy pineapple. And on the back, uh, we do have a nice little private balcony for it. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Like, I forgot about that, too. The nice little lining up in front of the windows. Uh, I wish they would make a graphic update. The graphics look um, old as dirt. Um, dude, this is console, man. Your, your console is not a PC, dude. This, this is the best it can do. Um, if you want any more graphics, you're going to have to wait till the next gen, dude. Um, I know that doesn't make sense to a lot of gamers who play stuff like Call of Duty, and they're like, well, Call of Duty can make it look nice. Um, this game overloads the, the console's processor and memory. Um, the consoles aren't made to do box games. They're made to play games like Call of Duty. Um, so games like this are really hard on the console unit. Oh, that's right. The, um, the Infinity Pool. I forgot about the Infinity Pool. That was a fun episode, too. Okay. Okay. So um, I showed you guys this house. That's actually my favorite cabin. Uh, you got a nice little balcony off there. Oh, I didn't show you the office. Oh, damn it. Damn it, forgot about the office. All right, um, the office is up there. It's a nice little office tucked in the corner right beside the, uh, the main bedroom. Uh, but this is my first house, the cabin house. I actually still really, really, really like this build. Um, mostly because this build was still a challenge, right? I couldn't do it all in concrete and then paint it. Uh, they kind of took away, like, the building challenge um, in the, the new alphas. But uh, this is a tunnel that goes all the way down to that panic tunnel I told you guys uh, that goes into the, the main complex over there. Okay, before we go on, actually, to the house and then um, Castle Miranda. Damn. Miranda, you look sexy. Oh, okay. Anyways, <laughs> I'm, I'm getting really... This is almost like catching up with someone in high school you haven't seen in, like, 10 years. You know what I mean? Uh, but let's go check out the uh, the other horde base here, at least from uh, the outside, and then we'll go and check it out from the inside. But this sucker here, I, I think this is what really did it for me, that, that launched my channel, um, was when I built this. Um, this doesn't work as well anymore. Uh, this design is a little antiquated because the zombies no longer just run off edges. Um, they'll just run, run around in circles above you if you're underground. Uh oh, it's Scot. Is it Scottish, um, Stephen? I'm sorry, I missed your reply there earlier. Um, a does a mean Scottish? <laughs> That's cool. But thank you very much, man. Very much appreciated. Merry Christmas to you too. Uh, but anyways, uh, so yeah, this is like the old old design right here, right? Um, what used to happen is I'd go up to the top on Horde Night, we'd stand up there, and zombies would start spawning in. And start coming at us like crazy, and then fall into the pit, and then we'll go down and start killing zombies. Wow, this place is taking a beating, too. 
Um, we go down into the pit and start digging on zombies, right? Um, but now, if I'm down there, they just run around in circles up here. And even if I wanted to go in the middle, they still don't run off the edge. They just get stuck in, like, in a forever loop. So this base is, like, completely obsolete. If I really wanted to fix it, what I would do is chop it off right here. Uh, chop off the whole tower and just keep myself at eye level with them. Because if you're at eye level, they actually will run off the edge. Um, you could also put plates and stuff around the side, like it, um, something that resembles a whole block, but actually isn't. That helps them run off the edge too, because they'll come to the edge, right, and run around in circles. Um, but they'll never actually go off the edge. But if you think they're, um, if you put another block along here, like something skinny like this up against the side, uh, they'll think that's a block and then they'll run across it in a circle and then fall off the edge. So um, that kind of saves the design, but... Yeah, this one's a little antiquated, but this um, this one here is really, well, I think, what really helped my channel take off. Day 280 Horde Night, guys, is my biggest video. I think it's um, I think it's approaching um, 1.5 million views now. Um, day 280, or it, yeah, day 280 Horde Night. That was it. It's um, approaching that many views, but um, you guys pretty know what that looks like in the bottom. Um, you've you've seen enough of those horde bases to kind of know what I did down there. Uh, there's a long ass tunnel as well too to get to that from uh, my underground base. Uh, would this seed still work? It, it it may actually if you tried using the same seed name, it actually may be different um, on a new version. I actually cannot um, cannot verify that. But what we got here is we got yeah like look gray water guys, gray motherfucking water. Wow. I haven't seen this depressing shit in such a long time. <laughs> I hate gray water. I always hated that all the water in the game was just gray. Um, so what this is, is basically just an infinity pool, right? Put some glass along the edge. You're good to go. Great view from here. Um, the extended view. Wait, they added the extended view distance now when I was still playing this playthrough. Like that was that was a thing. I remember because um, I was like, whoa, look at that, guys. We can see mountains. We can see the city over there. <laughs> God, good times, good times. Uh, so this is Casa Jeff here. This this um, this place, this place is a mansion. This place is huge. This is by far the biggest single house I've ever built in Seven Days to Die. Um, not the biggest build. If you guys seen Cooney Hills, oh my God, Cooney Hills. You could fit all of this inside Cooney Hills, and you wouldn't be, even be able to see it. <laughs> the Cooney Hills is huge. Um, but what we got here is we'll start off on this side here. This house has so many little details in it too. I love it. Um, this is of course your garage, right? Whatever. You got your garage, your way in there, but, um, let's go in the front door here and let's go in the front door. So this is your front door, right? You walk into uh, castle Jeff here into the front door. You got your main lobby up here. You got your second floor. Uh, you got your stairs up to the top. Oh, Hey, how you doing? What's up, Doug? What are you doing? Oh, I'm talking. That's that's why you're out there. He's actually been doing really, really well lately. He's been getting up by himself a lot. He's really responsive. No, don't you don't you get your snout caught in my headset. Yeah, you you sneaky bastard. Um, but anyways, why didn't I get a no notification? Uh, blatantly because YouTube's killing uh, gaming channels, dude. Um, they keep saying because um, like normally, guys, if you hit the the bell button, you should get a notification for a channel every single time they they do something. Um, but like with any gaming channel lately, it's just kind of gone to crap. Um, absolute crap. Anyways, so let's go in here. Uh, so this is the lobby that goes downstairs to the basement that goes upstairs to the uh, second floor. Um, in here, I never decorated it to be honest with furniture and stuff. In here is a waiting room. I guess you would call this like the little lobby waiting room area. Uh, if we go forward, we got hallway going down that way that leads to all the rooms and whatnot. Uh, this is the kitchen slash um, living room. Uh, we got another little front office here, like a little rec room, I guess you can call it. Uh, in here too, like I just I love all the different angles in this build, and I was able to hold this all together at the same time too. Hey guy, what's what's going on? Yes, yes, I love you. Oh, careful, don't fall. Good boy. Okay, so uh, we got all of this going on in here. I love it. So many angles, so good. Hey, Sergeant. Oh, Sergeant Timmy. How you doing, man? Holy crap. It's been a long, long time. Uh, had no internet for a week. I feel like I'm in the Stone Age. Oh, wow. Yeah, okay. Maybe it hasn't been a long, long time, but it definitely felt like it. Uh, this here is just like a little storage area. We're actually above the garage right now. Uh, so that's above the garage. 
Uh, that goes down in the basement. This goes up to the regular level. Uh, let's go ahead and go into this area. So this area here would be the kitchen, right? Obviously, I never really finished it. Um, we still need some cabinets and stuff to go along the bottom. Uh, but we got the kitchen in here. Nice, nice, great view. Nice little window over that way, too. Uh, this would be the, uh, the dining room, I guess. Yes, this would definitely be the dining room uh hey ch games dude um i would recommend um we're doing a little bit of a flashback right now because communities are broken and um they're not loading up um uh, honestly uh sergeant tim a I'm, I'm playing this playthrough and honestly dude i haven't had like any leg yet man like no leg yet so i'm thinking i i don't know like i want to finish this project okay okay no i'm on a tour of a house i'm on a tour of a house let's, let's get this tour done Hi, buddy. Yeah, just as distracted as I am right now, aren't you? Okay. Uh, so we've seen the kitchen and all that crap. So if we go this way, we've got a little bit of a supply closet in here. Not anything really to look at. Uh, here is where the main bedroom is. If you walk into here, you got like your little lobby, shoe room. You can, you know, take off all your coats and whatever. And then this is the master bedroom. I love this bedroom, actually. It's got a, a big peaked roof light or a ceilings like that. I love them. Uh, this place has two fireplaces or two fire chimney systems as well. There's like two chimneys in this entire place. Uh, so this place here, it offers you a great view with a wraparound balcony around the back, um, which also leads into the kitchen uh, living room area. And if we go over into here, uh, we actually have a little bit of a hot tub set up in here. So this is your uh, this is your hot tub room, right? <laughs> um, Alyssa, what? Are you a bot? I keep checking every day if you have a new video because I don't get notifications anymore. Well, guys, what I would recommend trying if you're not getting notifications anymore is just um, unselect the bell notification and select it again. Um, like, we've come at YouTube so many times. They're like, no, notifications aren't broken. Uh, they just keep denying it. It's blatantly obvious, and I've tested it out myself on, like, multiple devices. Um, fun fact, while we're sitting in my hot tub here. Oh, you know what? Okay. Nope, nope, I'm getting distracted. I was going to go to the rantatorium, but um, I think we'll just rant right here while I chill out in the hot tub. Um... <laughs> Jaybird. When I found this channel, so it's like going back to kindergarten. This is when I found his channel, so it's like going back to kindergarten. I know. I uh, fuck, I should have done this a long time ago, like a nice little, just you know where where we started and where we are now. Playthrough or thing going on. Um, oh, thanks, um, baby girl, uh, Eddie. Thank you very much. But yeah, basically they're they're killing off all the gaming channels right now and and like completely just denying anything. Uh, they did the same thing to. Um, um cartoonist i guess animators um a few years ago and now it's gaming again oh yeah fun fact i was going to tell you guys yeah here we go okay fun fact fun fact fun fact i had um like i have like five old cell phones right and i just kind of kept them so uh they're all good to go and stuff so what i did on them is i made uh youtube accounts okay listen to these fun facts i made youtube accounts five different youtube accounts all with bell notifications on i subbed to myself I subbed to KJ48 Games for Kicks and Game Edged. Um, and, and, uh, fuck, what's his name? Oh, I can't remember his goddamn name. One of the, one of the big vloggers. Uh, I never fucking watch him. Oh, Jake Paul, whoever the fuck that is. Honestly, guys, never seen a video. Was it Jake Paul? I don't know. It was one of them. It was one of them vlogger people who do that kind of stuff. Okay, I'm not even kidding you. Every single five devices did not get a single notification for any of those channels except for the vlog. It spammed the shit out of me for the vlog channel. But every single else, nothing. It, it, like, it's just blatant ev evidence that YouTube's killing off gaming channels on purpose. Uh, but yeah, And it's okay, guys. You know what I mean? That's, that's the way it's going. Uh, we'll figure it out and we'll go in a different direction, right? That's what we're doing right now. Uh, what we're doing to uh, negate that, because it's going to be hard to get growth in the community this way, is um, we're literally just getting tighter in the community. Uh, this is another bedroom here, guys. Um, nothing really special to say about this one. A little nice, nice little walk-in clause in here in a bedroom. Uh, but what we've been doing is like just kind of folding into Discord and going in different directions, right? Like I'm looking for sponsorships with games I enjoy. 
um you know what i mean so that way i don't have to rely on uh youtube for the for the money uh that kind of thing so uh this here is supposed to be a bathroom like i said i never got around to decorating actually decorating this place oh and then we got a front bedroom as well this front bedroom actually has a really really nice view look at that castle miranda right, right outside their front window oh i love it and look at this look at the look at the shadows oh this one doesn't have the fucked up shadows this version Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, let's go outside and take a look again. That's one thing I noticed. Yeah, no fucked up shadows. Whoa, did they fix that in the update? Or is this just this update? Anyways, so we've seen uh, the whole uh, main floor. We haven't gone to the basement or the top yet. <laughs> That's what I mean. This house is huge. Uh, so on the top, it's obviously not as big up here. Um, nice little view of the lobby and crap. Um, if you look over that way, there's a window to let in some sun. Um, for me, it was all the angles. I just, I love the multiple angles. It was, it was difficult. It wasn't easy. This build took a while. Um, a little bit was winged. A little bit was from like looking up other builds and stuff. So, um, this here leads down into the main bedroom. Uh, this here is just another auxiliary bedroom as it will be. If we go back into the corner over here, this, uh, there's another like creepy ass bedroom over here. It's actually a good size though. It's actually a good size with like a little bit of a walk-in closet. Um, and over here, everyone has this area in their house. That's just like it's an unfinished little room that you, you put all your old furniture in and stuff you just don't feel like throwing out. Um, it, all, it all ends up in here. So this is like your little storage room up in the corner of the house. And um, I even left a vent in it. Um, I did that on purpose, like left that there just to make it look like there is a vent. Uh, but that pretty much concludes this half of the top. Uh, like I said, it's a roof, right? So there's not that much room up here. Um, a little storage area in here for whatever you may put away. Um, this here is for the redheaded stepchild. This is where you put your redheaded stepchilds in. This is a redheaded stepchild room. That's what we decided on. Um, yeah, it was me. I was going to blame it on the viewers, but that was totally me. Uh, so this is where you put them. You know what I mean? Nice little room for them. Um, but one more floor to go here, guys. This floor is awesome, too. I really like this floor. Uh, so in this floor here, uh, this is where it leads into like the garage and area and stuff. Uh, we have a little room off to the side. Nice and creepy. This is, um, th see, like, this is where I'd put someone like Jared Bear. I'd put him in here. I'd be like, here's a desk. Here's a computer. Enjoy yourself. Have fun. Um, I think Jared would enjoy it. Oh, oh, as well, too, there's an actual, um, like, venting system running around the house. Like, I even ran the venting system so that it doesn't work, obviously. But um, I ran it around just to make it look, like, legitimate, like, like a house actually has them. Uh, so in here, we got another living room with um, the fireplace going on down there. Uh, over here, uh, we got another big, big living room. So there's a, like a lot of space in this house. Um, I think that's why I never decorated. I was just like, fuck it. And in here, we got um, two more rooms. We got one room here. And we got one room here with another door out. <laughs> oh, wait, this is a closet. That's right. There we go. Okay, cool uh let's go over this is a closet in here too don't really need to look at it uh over in the corner here as well we got a couple more bedrooms like there's so many bedrooms in this place it's insane uh so yeah that's pretty much it um now if i ever do a build like this again i'm actually going to go one block up so i can put windows in the basement because this basement has like no windows um jolene uh this could be your, your room this could be jay's room as i close the door and uh this little wait 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 that little creepy room over there that can be um that can be jerry's jerry's room how about that how about them apples right here there we go beautiful hey what's up jason welcome to the stream dude it's good hearing from you um so if you say if seed did work um still would it work um i have no idea dude i i have no idea if the seed will give you the same one man i would assume no but Anyways, so uh, this is my favorite room, actually, in this whole build. Uh, this is the utility room, right? This is where your heater and stuff is in. This is where you got all your stuff going. But if you check it out, like, we have a little bit of a crawl space under here. Got a little bit of a crawl space going on, right? If you check it out, it is also access to the uh, the panic tunnel that goes underground uh, to all of everything. Here we go. Let's drop down here. Boom. So, like, let's say it's emergency. Oh, shit. I forgot it's Horde Night. I need to bail. I will go through that room, run through this tunnel, which um, connects to the garage. There's the garage there for the the um, 
the cabin. Um, I think it's Casa Ritchie. I, I think Rick. I, I can't remember exactly, but and then back into my original base, which I already showed you guys. Uh, so let's go and take a quick look at Castle Miranda, my uh, my one love that I never got to love. Um, I never got to finish it. It was actually a really big regret. Hey, what's up, Wolf? How you doing, man? Oh, shoot. One second here, guys. I got to get uh, something up on my other window. My other window. My other computer that I completely forgot about. Here we go. Oh. Wow, I've just been talking like crazy. <laughs> oh, you guys can just see the corner of my ear. There we go. Nice. Uh, okay, awesome. Good to go. I just I always keep the stream um, on my other computer when I'm doing PS4, just so I can see, make sure everything's going all right on that end. But uh, here we go. We're back up to the surface now. And uh, this is Castle Miranda. Uh, you know what? I'm actually going to take a screenshot. It's really, really nice today, and it's not like we often get uh, too many days to do this. I'm going to take a couple screenshots because uh, I'm going to change the title and stuff for this stream. Unfortunately, uh, communities are down, uh, so we couldn't do multiplayer. Oh, the RNG for the red trees. Oh, yeah, when they added the uh, the red trees in. Oh, yeah, that was that was awesome. I remember that. Um, I almost feel like this still has that shitty freaking grass skin that looks like Minecraft. Like, this is a little too bright for my taste. Um, but anyways, this is Castle Miranda, guys. This project... Oh, oh, and by the way, each of those builds... You know how I built these guys uh, so that they weren't all fucked up? I built them out of frames first, and then I filled the frames back in. Uh, so this build here, this build is an actual building. Uh, the building, the castle's no longer there. It's actually torn down now. Um, oh, I see. It's because I'm getting too close to the other biome. It's going to end up turning. Um, we're, we're too close to the other biome right now. So, yeah. There we go. There we go. Actually, you know what? I'm going to take a screenshot of this, too. I don't think I have any really, really good screenshots of this. Uh, but this is Castle Miranda. This place actually ended up getting uh, torn down. Uh, so what I was doing um, before it got torn down was trying to build a replica of it. And actually, it turned out pretty damn good. Um, it's not an exact replica. I did do the outside a little different just because of the limited nature of blocks in Seven Days to Die. Like, I couldn't make, like, castle blocks and stuff. Like, like you know what I mean? Like, the, the concrete um, brick blocks and stuff like that. Like, I just didn't have them, so I couldn't make it look normal. Oh, we got a new sponsor, Rhett Mini. Dude, welcome to the channel, man. Or welcome to the channel. Uh, welcome to being a sub, dude. That's awesome. Show some sub faces for them, guys. Um, don't spam too much. I just want to see a few sub faces, or sub faces in there. Holy crap. <laughs> uh, so this is Castle Miranda. Huge, huge, huge project. Extremely complex. Um, spent hundreds of hours just on this part, I think. Um, but as you can tell, like literally all the rooms um what i did was i took the layout and i tried to do it best uh for meter by meter right some rooms are a little bit off but as far as the actual build goes um it's actually almost bang on like it, it's um on one side it's a couple meters too short um but other than that like the measurements are literally almost like star almost perfect oh yeah um, anyways, as you can see, this is how I build builds like this, especially when I don't have painting. Um, I just, I put the frames in and then I just end up replacing the frames with the blocks I want, right? Because it gives me a good, um, you know, I can look at it, I can visualize and I'd be like, oh, okay, well that looks like that. We should do this. And fuck, just looking at that makes me go cross-eyed. How the fuck did I do that? Jesus. Man, I miss building. Hey, what's up, Owen? How you doing, man? Um, have you gone? Uh, have you gone to the bridge over Detroit? I believe you called it. Hey, oh, the bridge! Yes, the bridge. Um, Maury, dude, I do apologize. Um, we look at self promotion in my stream as spam. Um, a because you know we usually we don't know who you are and um, no one's gonna follow you anyways when you do that. Um, oh. Oh, and the, guys, the wasteland here has no landmines in it, too, by the way. There's no landmines in the wasteland. Um, and, too, dude, like, if you, if you do want people to follow you, man, uh, you should become friends with them first, right? Like, that, that kind of 
stuff just drives people off. Um, we do have a spot in my Discord community, and if you are a content creator, we can take you as a content creator so other people know, and you can advertise yourself in there and make some friends. Um, but as far as like going to other channels, dude, and, and spamming their chat with like join my channel, especially for like a completely different game, um, it just it just doesn't work, man. Uh, take it from someone who tried it when they first started too. Uh, this tower here, though, like look at that. Jesus. No wonder my game lagged out like fucking mad. It's like, look at all those goddamn frames, Skippy. What are you doing to me? Wow. Okay. So what I started doing over here, because I kind of wanted to see, you know, what the final product was going to end up looking like. Um, I was visualizing it and stuff. So um, this is what I ended up uh, coming on, right? Like I was going to do a modern Castle Miranda with more of like a, a modern uh, feel to it, right? Uh, do I have Instagram? No, not really, dude. Hey, what's up, John? Welcome to the stream, dude. Um, I do want to do Castle Miranda, but honestly, I, 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 I'm thinking about it, and I think it's just better to do it on PC. Um, just simply because of the painting, or wait until console gets painting. One or the other, right? Um, because, like, this, dude, this was hundreds and hundreds of hours, and it still needs hundreds and hundreds of hours to finish, right? Um, just because of the process and and on top of that I still like I I don't know exactly where I ended where you know what I mean There's so much still left to do uh, But these towers and stuff you can get up to each and every single one uh, Let's go up in this one. This one's finished. So uh, let's get our butt up to the top here There we go. Nice nice. Holy crap. This brings back so many memories like look at this I even put details into the roof like I love that that little like flower leaf design thing all the different angles amazing uh so you can come up to the tower you can check out the view oh, it's pretty nice I, I like the view up here um and i do believe we can actually get to the outside somehow oh yeah with these windows wait is there a way to the top of that i completely forget um but like i said like everything guys every single block was placed with care um i use these um to indicate that there is a chimney in there because there's um a fireplace that goes all the way down to the bottom and it comes all the way out at the top of the building. And the actual building does have fireplaces coming out the top like that. Pretty damn cool, guys. Uh, so we got our roof. Wow. Just like, I nerd out over stuff like this, right? Like, I love seeing huge buildings that are just frames. Um, it fascinates me. It, it to like, to, 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 meh. to no end, it fascinates me. I love it. Okay. Right. So we got another tower here. Obviously, this one's not finished. Fuck, I'm hot. Okay, fine. I'll drink some water. Here we go. Anyways, you guys kind of see what I was doing here, right? Like, this was a lot of work. So much work. Um, I do regret not being able to finish it, though. Um, I just don't know if I can get back into it on this playthrough. It'd be hard. Um, but it's not laggy, like, at all. At all, at all. Which is really, really nice. I don't know if that's a new update or if it's been like this for a while. Uh, you can find them on the road. Oh, are you looking for tires? Yes, yes, they're right. You can look for tires on the road. Uh, I don't see any lag on my end, so maybe it's just YouTube acting up again. It could be just YouTube. It could be my internet. I don't know. Um, I tried streaming to YouTube yesterday, and it was really, it like, kept hitting a wall, like, dropping to zero all of a sudden. Um, so I was like, okay, well, I'm going to switch over to Twitch, right? Because I was passing my speed test. And then, like, after two hours on Twitch, my speeds went to shit again. So, um, I, I don't know. I, I couldn't explain that to you at all. But there we go. So this is, our, like, our little bit of a city here. We caught our whole city. Um, this here, too. This is also one of my huge, huge projects. If we look at my map here, uh, let's whip out the map. I made a big, big-ass bridge. I called this city down here Detroit. It's all burnt out and it's kind of useless. Um, but what I did was I made, a, I made a bridge to it, right? And not just like a bridge where it's like, oh, look, a pole and some supports. Like, I went all out with this bridge. Um, this here is all sod. Uh, the whole bridge is sod. So even just like the bridge surface was a job and a half. Like, I had to punch so much grass. There was so much grass punching going on. Hey, uh, Lainey, what's up? Slow mode is to add, uh, yes, sorry guys, um, slow mode is on to stop, uh, people who like to spam stuff. Um, it's only, like, two seconds, so, like, if you do have something to say, just try to fit in one paragraph, and, and honestly, too, guys, as a streamer, when you're, like, say something, say something, say something, say something, 
and there's like 10 other people saying something it's really hard to like put that all together right so um if you if you do want to talk to me just please you know put it all in one paragraph it's a little easier but yeah this bridge is a whole kilometer long i believe it's a long long bridge um i guys okay this play to through too i could never find myself a nail gun so i did this whole bridge of cobblestone with a fucking hammer like i went out so many times to find a nail gun and i could not find one what are you staring at me for buddy i will play with you in a bit okay um but yeah, here we go. We're going to go across. Keep going. Oh, wow. Like, the world's loading in fast, too. We usually have to stop and wait. Has Have they fixed the load times for the worlds in the last update? Like, the performance just seems much better. Like, going across this bridge, it used to be, like, Lake City, right? Because it would have to spawn it all in and crap. I uh, hear from Neebs Gaming. Enjoy watching your channel now. Hey, Jeremy. What's up, dude? Welcome to the channel. I'm uh, glad you took your time to stop by, dude. Especially when you watch um, really quality creators like Neebs Gaming. You know what I mean? Um, I strive to be like them one day, hopefully, maybe. But for now, uh, what we are is just a, a gaming community and um, casual like streaming and stuff. And I like to make videos. And we like to play games together. We're playing uh, Warframe. Uh, we were playing Lord uh, Lord's Mobile, but uh, things ended up getting a little dramatic over there. So I um, kind of just stepped away from that stuff. Uh, but there we go. Yeah, we have our um, our bridge to Detroit, guys. So on the way back, I'm actually going to go down because you guys probably looked at the top there and went, ah, oh, yeah, whatever. You know, it's just a long bridge. Um, look what I did with the poles down here, too. Like, there's more than that. There's more than that. Um, I put a lot, a lot of detail into these things. And apparently, I forgot to take out the middle supports because how I would build this sucker, okay, is I would build a support. See how the, the support's going right there? I'd build the support up. Oh, fuck off. Oh, fuck off. Whoa. Dogs. <laughs> First fucking zombie I see, and it's a goddamn dog. Jesus Christ. Okay. Wow, look at all the dogs. There's another one over there. What the fuck? Oh, yeah, this is the old spawn rules. Okay, okay. Um, oh, fucking dog. I want to show you guys this shit. I should have just turned off spawns. Um, but anyways, what I would do is I would get halfway down with the concrete blocks because you can't span this far normally with just concrete. Oh, crap. <laughs> I fucking get stuck on shit, too. And there's there's no landmines, by the way, guys. This playthrough is so old that there's no landmines in, in the, uh, the biome. But you guys kind of see that, right? Like, I would support it, and then once it dried and it was all upgraded to steel, I'd come out and take out the supports. But apparently, I forgot a few down this way. Um, but like even all of the supports are highly decorated. I made the I wanted to make the bottom of the bridge um, Look realistic, right? Like I could have went through with all of that and I could have just used um, Iron frames because iron frames have the same hold um, As those blocks do and those blocks are expensive as fuck to make right? Um, I even had a few other content creators go. Oh, you should just use blah blah blah, blah. and I'm like guys when I build I go all out I make it all look realistic, right? Like, if it's supposed to be supported, I'm going to make it look like a support. That's just, that's just how I roll. <laughs> um, but yeah, this this bridge project, too. This this spanned, I think, a whole almost two weeks of episodes. It was a lot of episodes. Welcome to the old wasteland. <laughs> yes, yes, the good old wasteland. Um, but yeah, so you guys see how much work I put in this playthrough. This playthrough is insane. Um, the game has gotten actually, since this playthrough, the game's actually gotten easier by like threefold. Uh, so this project now would probably take me a third back then. Um, every like update and every alpha, they just, they make this game more and more like Minecraft. Because, well, you make a hard game, a lot of people don't want to play that, right? They want to pick up a game and feel like they're winning at life. Um, so they've, they've slowly made this game more and more what, um, I guess you would call accessible to other players, which is okay. You know what I mean? That's where mods and stuff step in and, and difficulty settings. Um, but, uh, like this playthrough guys, hundreds and hundreds of hours. It's insane. Like castle, even castle Miranda, just looking at it now, I'm like, holy fuck. Like looking at it, it's making me feel sick because it's such a big project. <laughs> That project was huge. Uh, but anyways, let's go, let's go back down into our tunnel here. We will park my car. And then we'll... Oh, and by the way, fun fact. Um, you used to be able to go through... 
Jesus fucking Christ. You used to be able to go through um, pillars with your mini bike. Um, now you can't. And that's why this base has a whole bunch of pillars like this around it. Because I used to just drive my mini bike through it. I used to just boop right through it, right? Uh, but now you, you get stuck, so... Um, yeah, this, this playlist here, uh, my first one has, what, 80, 83 videos, you said? Um, altogether, I think I have a good 170 PS4 videos alone. Um, not to mention the streams and stuff, too. Okay, there we go. Stupid friggin' pillar in my way. <laughs> so, uh, we got our garage down here. This is where I park my mini bikes and stuff. This is where I keep everything. Uh, um, open up roof. Um, down here is um the access to oh yes down here i'm sorry oh jesus a little bit of lag again sorry guys um down here is the access to uh the for the horde base right you can drop down there quickly or down here is a direct access to my room so we're gonna drop down here take another quick look um because i know a lot of people just joined us uh so we'll take another quick look around here if you guys see look at that Ooh, la, la. this is my place this is my digs my my fancy old digs uh, so much fun. Uh, this is Bob over here. I don't know if you guys have ever heard me say fuck Bob. Um, but this is what started it all. Um, if you guys really want to know the Bob story, um, watch my first playthrough. Uh, there's a Bob story in there. Um, now they got my kitchen, storage room, and, uh, the good old rantipatorium in here. <laughs> good old rantipatorium. Um, honestly, those, those rants were fun and stuff back in the day, but I'm kind of, I'm kind of glad I'm past that now. Okay, so, um, that goes down to an area where I was farming out a whole bunch of stone. I was going to make an underground city. I had so many plans for this playthrough, but it got, it got fucked up. Like, the, and it, would, it would constantly crash and lag and stuff. Um, uh, but if we take the tunnel through here, this, this unfinished tunnel, this will lead us directly to underneath, uh, that horde base I showed you guys earlier. Um, how many deaths and kills on this playthrough? I noticed water in the hole in the bucket, the empty roof field glitch. Oh yeah, that, that still works. Um, that still works, Timmy. Um, what I do now, honestly, man, is I find a winter biome and I just go and get a bunch of snow and then that lasts me uh, for quite, quite a while. Okay, so this is where like my factory is, right? I have all my heat machines in here. All my forges are in here. Um, oh, look, forges are actually going. Oh, holy shit. What are these even making? Stuff. Excellent. Okay, I have no idea what's going on there. Uh, this room here is directly below where all the zombies land, so I can come down here and loot and do stuff. And uh, zombie bodies would drop down here too. Uh, they would actually like end up glitching through the blocks and stuff and drop down here, and I'd be able to go and get them. Uh, now, hey, hey blah. how you get to the second floor here is you just go up one of the sides um, of the ladders, and then there you go. And uh, now, originally, I had this all pillars like every single so the zombies would fall down here and it was a pillar design right um but eventually i ended up getting tired of like you know playing um too safe and uh i opened it up right and i spent like hours pounding through all the steel and all the bullshit right um didn't and still even when did a little bit of that too i was gonna pound this out but it never happened i just ended up filling it in i think um but I, I like, took all this out, got it all ready, I, you know, did a little bit more upgrading steel, um, did a horde night right after an update, and it was when they, um, they fucked the AI, when they fucked the AI up. Um, so they started running around in circles above me, right, and uh, made this horde base useless. So I never actually got to use this horde base um, after the edit, which, which really sucks. But um, this still works. Like I said, still works if you cut off that tower at... Um, at eye height with the zombies and stand in the middle because the zombies will look at you and try to run at you if you're eye height with them. So um, it does work that way, but eh, it is what it is, right? All right, cool stuff, guys. Wow, that was a nice, uh, nice little tour of my original playthrough. It took almost a full hour to do that, a full hour tour of my Castle Miranda playthrough. Um, but yeah, there's so many memories, so many feel goods here, guys. Um, it was kind of nice actually coming and doing this. Um, our community is working again. You know what? We're going to exit this and we're going to go and see if communities are working again. Because uh, if they are, then I'm going to start up our multiplayer um, save. Uh, that's why we're not doing multiplayer right now is because communities are apparently down. Okay. Let's, uh, let's look up here. We're going to go to communities and check this show out. Hey, Summer. What's up, dude? Uh, your communities. All right. Damn, it doesn't look like it. It's doing the whole um, triangle, circle, square, triangle. 
thing. <laughs> I remember that horror night. Oh, I was so pissed too. I was just like, what the hell is this? What is happening right now? And you know what's funny too is when people like comment on those new videos, they're like, you're such a dumbass. It's because the zombies don't come off the side. And I'm like, dude, look at the date. Who's a dumbass here? <laughs> Seriously. It's funny though. I, I laugh at those ones. Um, remember the ladder glitch? Oh, yes. The update that um, every time you hopped off a ladder, it would zero your hunger. So you'd like, you'd go up, 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 get off a ladder, and your hunger would drop to zero. Um, I got pissed off at that one a little bit too, but I actually ended up using that to get my wellness up. I would just run up the ladder, eat a bunch of stew, get my wellness up, right? I took it, uh, I took it well. Uh, do I have a guild on Warframe? Not yet, Knight. I still have to look into how to do it, man. Oh, fuck. Guys, I'm sorry. I really wanted to do multiplayer today. Um, I don't really feel like playing my single player at the moment. Uh, so I think I'm unfortunately going to have to end the stream here. Um, I might come back later and do like some, some Warframe or maybe some Wylands on the channel. I know you guys like those games as well. Um, what I'm like, what I'm saying I'm doing is we're expanding our community, right guys? Come join us on Discord. Do exclamation mark Discord in the chat. It will give you the direct link to join us on Discord. Uh, we have multiple people, multiple platforms, multiple games. It's a great place to come and find people. Um, it's a pretty safe place. We're pretty heavy with the, the ban hammer when it comes to assholes. Um, we, we have no fear of banning people. So, um, don't come and be an asshole cause you won't last long. Like we just, it doesn't even fizz us. Like, honestly, guys, I've been doing this for so long. I am so used to trolls. <laughs> it's not a big deal at all. Hey, what's up? Uh, what's up, Cassie? Welcome back. Uh, Summer Dread says, okay, peace. Uh, Steven says a whole year, a whole hour. Yeah. It literally took a whole hour to tour, tour this. Now guys, uh, to explain too, maybe we'll do a little bit of catch up here while I got a second. Um, why I haven't been playing seven days of dies so much lately is because the fun pimps just hired a whole crap load of people. And, um, like it's now been over six months since alpha 16 dropped worst alpha the game has ever seen period. The AI was even more broke than it was before. Um, the game just ran like crap. They, they, they threw a whole bunch of content into it and we're like, well, you know, fuck it. Let's just throw this out there and uh, let them play it with like AI that runs around in circles. I don't know if you guys have seen PC content, but literally the zombies, when they're running, they'll run at you and then stop and then run around in a circle, run past you, run around in a circle. Like it, it's, it's absolutely frustrating. So um, they recently updated their dev log to say that Alpha 17 won't be out until well into 2018. And I just literally went, no excuse guys. The game has sold like what, 25 million copies or something stupid like that? Or uh, 10 million copies, I'm sorry. I don't know the exact number, so don't get me off that. But these guys have sold a ton of copies. Why the fuck are we four years into an alpha and you're taking a year with a brand new team to release an update that has no content in it? Because the, the new update doesn't have content. They're like, oh, we're just going to bug fix. So instead of fixing the horrible AI and saying, you know what, let's, let's delay the um, the other content. We'll, we'll fix the AI, but we'll delay the content. No, they just expect all their fans to deal with the shitty AI for another, what, six months or however long it might take them. So yeah, I just, I literally went, you know what? I'm tired of this. Um, personally, I'm tired of shit finished, uh, shit half finished alpha games with devs that just don't give a shit, right? Um, you could tell the fun pimps really don't give a shit. They don't. Four years in, the game's still not fucking finished and they've made millions of dollars. Zero excuse. Um, in my opinion, if I had that much capital, this game would have been done like a year, right? And then I would have been moving on to the next project. You don't make money that way. Um, it's just laziness, but that's only my opinion too, guys. I know a lot of people are really big fans of the fun pimps and seven days to die. Um, but it's just from my experience as a content creator, as a person who's played the game for a very long time, um, a year between alphas is a, is a joke, especially when they're dropping alphas that are extremely broke. So I know a lot of you like lately have been like, why haven't you been doing seven days to die as much? And that's why, cause I, I'm not enjoying it. And I don't feel like waiting another six months, um, with broken AI and stuff. Um, Strange the community isn't loading for you. No problems here. I was I was done eating. Really? Maybe it's just um, regional then. Where, where are you, Nikolai? Because um, like right before the stream, people were like, we can't get communities to come up. And I'm like, hawk. Of course, Saturday, I'm going to stream multiplayer PS4. Communities aren't going to work. <laughs> oh, you guys can see my avatar on PS4. Isn't it beautiful? I love my avatar. Let's take a look here. It's a beautiful, beautiful avatar. 
Actually, you can see it really well in the community. There we go. It's you, Jay. Check it out. Check it out. It's you. I took a picture of you, man. I uh, followed you that one night to that really strange bar you went to. But that, that's you. <laughs> they may have felt me as I love pancakes. That's hilarious. Why does it say that? Um, I set up this account way, way back when PS3 first came out. Uh, <laughs> that's funny, though. That that's still my display picture on PS4. That is hilarious. How do I join Discord? Uh, do exclamation mark Discord. It'll give you a uh, direct link to the Discord, man. And honestly, dude, it's a heart of our community, man. Um, what you're seeing on YouTube here is just a, a little part of what we do, right? Like, we play a lot of games and stuff together. Um... It's a great resource too. Like if you're lost in a game uh, and there's other people playing that game, it's um, extremely helpful community, right? Like especially Wildlands right now. Very little documentation on Wildlands. We're all learning it. Um, I sent that in confidence. <laughs> yeah, Jay, stop. Well, at least I didn't put the new one up. Communities are working for me in the Eastern US. Ah, oh, that's weird. I, I don't know. Like um, right before the stream, people were like, oh, 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 okay, never mind. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Freaking internet's just been weird lately, guys. Like, if you know what I mean? Like, yesterday, yesterday I couldn't access Google at all for, like, 30 minutes. Like, anything Google. YouTube, Google search, anything. But everything else ran smoothly. It's like, what the fuck's going on with the internet lately? Oh, my God. Uh, but anyways, guys, um, I think I'm going to end it here. Uh, I had a blast today. Unfortunately, I was going to do, like, a four-hour multiplayer stream. But since this is happening... <laughs> There's no point, right? It was good doing a little bit of a tour, though, and catching up with you guys, for sure. Uh, so, I'm... Yeah, like, I swear net neutrality is kicking in already, dude. I swear it's already kicking in. They're already fucking with shit. Because um, ever since, like, that day, man, like, I've just... I've had random issues accessing, like, different parts of the internet, man. And you know what I mean? It could just be tinfoil hat. It could be true. You never know. But, hey, we'll take it one... I'm proud to be Canadian at this point. We still have net neutrality and our government stands up for it. And every single cable company, like even though I fucking hate my cable company, guys, every single cable company here came out when that was voted in in the States and said, we are for net neutrality. We have no desire to uh, to go in that direction. So even our own companies were like, yeah, no, fuck that. No, nah, no, we're, we're good here. We're good here. We don't we don't need to throttle other sites and stuff because, you know, um, there's still a little bit of a consumer protection, but hopefully it works out guys. Hopefully it all doesn't go to shit and, uh, you know, the people get what they want. Um, either way, I'm still here. I'm not going anywhere guys. Uh, I'm going to pick a part-time job in January to take a little bit of the brunt off. Um, but I'm not, I'm still here. I'm not going anywhere. I don't give a shit. YouTube can uh, fuck me in the ass all they want. I'll lube it up first. You know what I mean? <laughs> or just switch over to Twitch, but. I still prefer YouTube as a streaming platform. Anyways, guys, I'm going to go. I could talk like this all day with you. <laughs> all right, stream, uh, stream Warframe. Yeah, I might stream Warframe in a couple hours. I'm going to go and uh, take care of my dog. He wants some playtime. He's extremely um, responsive today, so I should take advantage of that. He's 18 years old, guys. He doesn't have... He'll he be 19 in freaking March, right? He doesn't have much longer left. Um, even getting up by himself is a whole feat right now. So he, he gets proud. He gets up. He comes over and he comes uh, comes and looks at me. He's like, look what I did. It's awesome. I love it. Love him to death. But anyways, okay. I'm going to say bye, guys. Enjoy the end stream. Peace out. And uh, stay classy if you can. And back up them game saves. Peace out, guys. Have a good one.